Webb, the king and queen of Sam Crow. We meet again. We meet again. Hi, yes. Uh, and I was just uh, telling your, your lovely publicist, this is our only chance to get your thoughts now, is watching the show and talking to you on the red carpet, because you've disappeared from the digital world. Oh, yeah. I'll be back. <laughs> you've, got, you've got to. But, I know they miss him, right? <laughs> I, I miss him. Life is markedly different. Yeah. Um, so, a lot of amazing guest stars this season. We've got Danny. I'm personally a big fan of Rockman. I love Terriers. I guess it's tragic, but it's Sam Crow's gain, of course. Um, any uh, any standouts? Any favorites? I know it's hard to pick favorites, but anybody who's particularly got a meaty role. You know, they all. Uh, it's 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 great. It's it's great because we. You know, I I, I write. I have a. A general sense of, uh, of what the season is going to be, but I don't really know exactly how it's all going to play out. So it's been great to have these guest actors on, whom don't, who I'm sort of figuring out who they are as we do it, and having the freedom to like say, oh, they're they're this guy or they're that guy. And Rockman is one of those guys who you know brought so much to the role. Ray McKinnon is doing an awesome job. Uh, Danny's Danny's such a badass. Danny's doing such a great job. So they're all. It's very interesting. They're all like um, Rock. Rockman and Ray's character are very much in, enmeshed, and then Danny's sort of this little satellite over here, you know, that they're dealing with, but not really, they don't really have any scenes together, you know, so uh, uh, it's just, uh, I don't know, I just think it'll be a, a really different, um, a, a really different way for us to use guest stars this year, in that there's not a clear-cut, um, you know, by the numbers antagonist, like there have been right. in, the, not, in the previous. It's the big bad of this yeah. season, like yeah. a lot of shows do. Yeah. yeah. You know, like we've done in the past, you know, there's not a Zobel this season, you know. Um, yes, there's a new law enforcement component, and, uh, you know, and, and, there's, and there's challenges that they have, but there's not an, an identifiable, really a, a straight up identifiable an, an, an antagonist. Well, in my mind, uh, in a lot of ways, the villain throughout the whole show is really kind of clay, one could argue. Yeah, I mean, I think ultimately. Yeah, I mean, I think ultimately, you know, the the biggest antagonist to the club is the club, and it's always been the case. And and you know, uh, and you know, it's 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 just comes with the territory when you you know when you make that decision to live by the rules of being an outlaw. You know, there's. Uh, that comes with the territory, you know what I mean? Uh, and it's always been Jax's challenge, you know? Am I that guy or am I this guy, you know? Right. So, am I in or am I out? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, uh, but no, one could definitely argue that, uh, uh, that, uh, that, that, that Clay could be, uh, you know, be considered uh, the, the driving force behind evil on the yeah. show. Yeah. Well, I really loved how the end of season three really kind of brought us back to that Hamlet, Shakespearean, overarching story through the show um, in what ways are you are you still sort of married to seeing that play through and in what way do you, you ever feel saddled by that like you know are you able to still play with it and I, smart questions I just I, I, uh, I just blogged about this uh, like a couple of weeks ago just that you know that ultimately the Hamlet stuff was it was this great sort of um, archetype to, to, to bounce off of coming into the show and and uh, you know, and that the thematically we touch on it, and that perhaps as we wind down the series, and if we're given the opportunity to do that, then we can, you know, then perhaps there'll be more of that come out uh, in terms of themes, and perhaps even some, some, you know, narrative lifts from that from that mythology as well. Um, but uh, I do think it'll come back around. I don't think it'll be, it'll come back around in a, in a you know, n not everyone's going to end up, you know, right. you know, we don't know exactly, exactly, how it ends. you know, really? yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, guys, gotcha. We're all, we all ask these questions.